What's going on, everyone? This is from FK here. So today, Cardinals lost five to one to the Chicago Cubs in the final game of this five-game series on Labor Day today. And um, well, we let's see, we won three. So I guess let's see, the Cubs won the first one, then we uh, swept the doubleheader. And then we won again on Sunday. And yeah, so I guess we take we take three out of the five. Uh and yeah, regardless, uh pretty good. Glad, glad we took three out of five from a solid Cubs team. Um but uh couldn't really get the offense going in this one as we lose five one. And Yadier Molina in this game actually had to leave the game in the fifth inning due to a bruised elbow injury. So, I haven't really heard anything else about it. Hopefully it's not too bad, but, yeah, I think he should be fine. Um, anyway, so the Cubs take an early one nothing later on a RBI ground up by Anthony Rizzo. Put them up one and nothing, uh, And then they go up 2 nothing on a RBI double by Rizzo to put them up 2 nothing, and then Jason Kipnis and RBI double to put them up 3 nothing, And Cardinals rookie pitcher Johan Oviedo was pretty good in this one. He would go 4 and a third, uh, give up those three runs, um, and Wilson Contreras had an RBI double to put the Cubs up 5 to nothing. Um, and then our only run of the game was driven in by Matt Wieters, uh, who was replacing Yachty. Um, so, and Cubs pitcher Kyle Hendricks was very good in this game. Uh, he would go eight innings, strike out four, give up just a run, um, no walks. He was very good. And our bullpen was very good again as well. I uh, got to see Seth Elich pitch scoreless inning, uh, and as well as Rob Kaminsky scoreless inning as well for him. So but we lose five one, and uh, we'll have a long homestand this week, uh, which will include two double headers Tuesday and Thursday. Uh, Tuesday, so tomorrow we host the Minnesota Twins, and then Thursday we host the Detroit Tigers. So, yeah, we still have a lot of double headers, and then the uh, Cincinnati Reds come to town this weekend. So, um, but yeah, so you know we're still very much in the playoff picture. If the playoffs ended today, or if the playoffs started today, we would be in. So. Um, but yeah, so, and I'm not sure who's going to start in game one tomorrow. Uh, I don't think we've announced it. Of course, Kwon Young Kim uh, is on the injuries list after having a, apparently it was some, like, kidney, uh, procedure or something. I'm not really sure. Uh, but he is out of hospital, but, uh, still on the injured list, so. But, um, yeah, so anyway, see what happens Tuesday against Minnesota at home. First game, I believe, is at 2 o'clock. Yeah, still down to my face saying go cards.